Hey everyone, Chef Rob Schwamm here with Link2. I want to show you how to cook vegetables in the Blodgett BLCT 6E Mini Combi uh, with the ventless attachment. Awesome. So I have my green beans right here. Um, and in the control panel, I'm going to hit recipes. I'm going to scroll all the way down to vegetables. And then from here to green beans. And I made a note to myself, uh, soft steam. So in here, I have a preheat, and then after it's preheated, it'll tell me to load. And then I will go at 190 degrees for six minutes. I'm gonna hit start, and then it'll go through its preheat. Um, why I'm, I'm showing you this, um, the mini combi, is as technology advances, we're able to do a lot of ventless applications. You see Houdini by Blodgett, um, you can stick a ventless hood over the top so I don't need any, any uh, ventilation hood and I can plug and play this virtually anywhere and have, again, the most versatile piece of equipment in a kitchen um, in a very small footprint. So as it's going through its preheat, I just want to talk about different sizes. Um, this being ventless, this is the smallest combi size you can get in a six pan, um, which means that six half sheet trays or four two and a half inch hotel pans. Um, but you can get all the way up to eight full sheet trays. Um, some are offered in Ventless, some aren't. Um, so reach out in, in case you want to you know more about Ventless and all that. Um, but in a very small footprint, in my opinion, you have the most versatile piece of equipment on the market. So I have my prompt to load the beans, which I put in my program. And I'm ready to load. Now I have this setting at 190 degrees, again, not full on 212 steam because I like to keep a lot of nutrients and, and uh, mouthfeel and, and crack in my green beans as well as, as vibrant. They're very, very uh, clean looking green um, and you'll see it after six minutes, they're perfectly done. They're not overcooked and they can hold up on a steam table uh, lineup much longer. Six minutes, uh, it says that my recipe is done. Look at how vibrant and green these, these green beans are. Done in a perf pan, uh, but six minutes you have perfectly good green beans ready to go on the line. Another solution for cooking vegetables is roasting with combi, which is a combination between convection oven and steam. So if, if I have a warm environment, and I add steam in, it speeds up the cook so much faster. It, it gives a nice juicy bite to any type of vegetables or protein that you might have. Um, and it's, it's way more accurate in cooking. Um, and let me show you how to do that. So you'll go into recipes, again, vegetables. And I have two types of, pro of, of programming for broccoli. Do I want steamed uh, broccoli or do I want roasted broccoli? I'm gonna hit the roasted. And now I have a preheat of 550 degrees. It'll prompt me to load my broccoli and then 425 degrees um, at 40% steam um, for five minutes. So very, very fast cooking, small footprint, ventless, plug and play, go. All right, so the preheat's done. We're at 550 degrees, a really, really hot oven, and now it's ready for the broccoli. Now I just oiled salt and pepper on it. Doesn't have to be too crazy, but with this oven, very vibrant, awesome flavors. And I. I'm utilizing some steam, so I have 40% steam, so I'm kind of steaming it as well as hitting it with some really, really hot air at 425 degrees um, so that I, I char the outside and cook the inside with the steam. All right, so my broccoli is done. Five minutes at 425 degrees, you can see a nice char. Um, beautifully cooked, but a ton of steam coming off, meaning that uh, the inside is cooked and we're ready to serve. All right, so here you have two different methods of cooking in the same exact oven in the mini combi. Versatility. I have my soft steamed green beans and my roasted broccoli, um, all done within 20 minutes of each other, changing different parameters, uh, being able to steam and then roast off. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please ask any questions if you have any, and I hope you guys are enjoying the conference. Thank you.